Hello, everybody, and thanks for joining us. I'm Tracy Carlos. Tonight, police are looking for the hit and run driver who ran down a teenager. It is the second time in two days that there's been a hit and run accident involving a child here in Cleveland. Police say 15 year old Wiley Orr was hit while crossing the street last night, and Friday, nine year old Miguel Torres died after being run down. Police just released the woman accused of leaving the scene after hitting the nine year old with her car. News Channel 5's investigator Sarah Buttison has been working on these stories today. And Sarah, what can you tell us tonight? Tracy, today police said investigators have little to go on as they try to find the driver who ran down 15 year old Wiley Orr. Ruth says drivers often ignore the speed limit on Union Avenue on Cleveland's east side. It's pretty dangerous right here. Last night, one driver did sure. something much worse. Police say 15 year old Wiley Orr was crossing Union Avenue at 99th Street when someone hit him and kept driving. It's wrong, and someone should speak up, and or they should turn himself in. This is showing me that every moment is precious. It is the second hit and run in two days involving a child in Cleveland. Bobby Reed Torres's nine year old son, Miguel, was killed Friday while crossing the street on the west side. Miguel loved life. Miguel loved people. Miguel loved his community. In his case, police say the driver turned herself in. Officers released Adriana Flores this afternoon. She came forward. That's the bottom line. Finding the driver who hit Wiley Orr will be tougher. Police say they don't know what kind of car hit him or who was behind the wheel. I don't like to hear something like that. My heart goes out to his family. Police say they released Adriana Flores today because they are still investigating the hit and run she was involved in. As for Wiley's Orr's case, there is good news tonight. He is in stable condition at Rainbow Babies and Children's Hospital here in Cleveland. If you have any information that could help find the driver, go ahead and call the number that is on the bottom of your screen right now. That is Cleveland Police's. Uh, hit skip unit. Go ahead and call them if you have any information that could help find the driver who ran down the teen. On your side, I'm investigator Sarah Buttison, News Channel 5. Okay, Sarah, thanks very much for your live report. The